All right, boss. Welcome. It's a girl that's trying to hit me here, aka Sister Sense. Yes. I am back at it. We are going to have a conversation today about how to make a hundred dollars a day. The digital products create and sell digital products profit plan. So I'm super excited to jump on and have this conversation with you guys. A little story time before we get started. I have been here in the beautiful, beautiful location of South Carolina, Myrtle Beach. Um, for the last couple of days, we're on day three of our four days. And a few days ago, I posted on Instagram. I said, listen, every entrepreneur should be making at least $100 a day selling at least one awesome digital product, okay? And one of the ladies in my circle said, I 100% agree. I just don't have any. It's not, it's not working for me. So I said I was going to jump on here and do a live so I can talk about your digital products, your services, all the things that you do, your monetization too, how you should be, how you can be generating revenue consistently in your online business. That's our conversation today, okay? So of course, as always, let me know who you are and where you are in this beautiful world today. If you're catching me on the replay side, drop into the comment box, hashtag replays rock and feel free to tag a business bestie and or share this out sharing is caring that's what it's all about especially if you know other entrepreneurs who are looking to get intentional about reaching their everyday sales goals getting ready for revenue creating digital products to all the things that's what i'm going to talk to you about today as part of this boss on the beat conversation situation so it's really sunny i'm gonna do my best to see who's hanging out with me hi danielle hey awesome to see you here my dear um and we are going to dig into the conversation okay so i figured the best way to do this was to actually take you through this the contents to cash flow digital product planner and i created this so I could help entrepreneurs work on their digital products, their services, and really get clear about what it is they want to monetize and sell online to generate revenue. This, by the way, is at sisasense.shop, okay, if you're curious. So in the very beginning of this, there's information about how to watch the training because there's audio and video and training that goes with this. And there is also information about your products, your pricing, and developing what I like to call a money map. So the first thing that I want us to do is to talk about in order to make a hundred dollars a day in revenue, what does that look like, right? What is the money map to reach that goal? So I don't know if you can see this. Okay. My hubby was just here a while ago. I don't know where he went, but anyway, um, okay. So this is the make a hundred dollars a day money map. And I don't know how well you can see this because it is very, very sunny. Okay. So I'm going to verbally walk you through this right here. Essentially, the first thing that you have to do is have at least one, ideally have a few offers that can work really well for you. So of course the goal is at least a hundred dollars a day. So if you were to have a digital offer and let's say it was a hundred dollars, just need to sell one of that to hit your goal on a daily basis, right? Let's say you had one offer that was $50, then simple math, 50 times two got you $100 a day, right? The average for me, especially when it comes to creating LPPs, a low price point offers, is to have an offer that's at least $25, right? So if you've got like a $25 digital product, let's say an ebook, and you sell four of those a day, that can help you hit your goal of $100 a day, okay? And if you have a $10 digital offer, I love to talk about my 10-10 win strategy. If you have a $10 offer, okay, let's see, 10 times 10, that's 100. So I break down, this is the first part of the money map. There are several pages in here about pricing and profit. But just kind of really logistically, okay, looking at what it would actually take to hit that goal. So 
the next thing that I actually want to do is to talk to you about these specific type of offers that you could potentially put together, especially when it comes to creating either an offer that's, let's say, $25 or $100 that you can focus on and intentionally promote. So they're setting up here. I may have to slide over, and I already got myself perfectly situated with y'all, but I may have to slide over in a minute, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see how that works out, okay? So let's talk about some intentional offers that you can put together. So for those of you who are here, by the way, let me know. Say, hey, hey, hey. Hi, Anissa. Great rising to you. Hey, Cindy. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Especially if y'all are catching me on the replay side, you can also just kind of check in and let me know who's watching. First thing that I want you to do is to think about either if you have an offer, what kind of price points you're selling your offers at, right? Ideally, we're going to work around offers that are in the $25 range or even a $100 offer. That's what we're going to focus on today, okay? And hopefully, I can share with you some strategies of ideas of offers that you can potentially put together if you don't already have one. And like I mentioned before, we're going to do this as part of the Digital Products Planner um, don't know if you have it, but if you do have it, you want to go to the money map section. Uh, and that first part that I talked about crunching the numbers, thinking about if you have an offer at $10, you do $10 offers, average 10 sales a day, that's $100. A $25 offer, average four sales a day, that's $100. $100 offer, baby, you just need one sale a day to have to hit that $100 goal, right? Okay. So that was the first part of this conversation today. Let's crunch the numbers, okay? So let's move into, for me, number two, which is sharing with you some digital product ideas. So how I created this particular book is I broke it into, I wanna say 21 different types of digital products that I sell, all the way from A, B, C, D, E, and F. So I call these my ABCs to digital product content creation. The first one that I want to talk to you is about audios, okay? So let me actually pop that page up on the screen. Don't know if you can see it, but if you can, awesome, because I know it's super, super sunny. Uh, let me know if you can actually see <laughs> this right here. Um, but this is on audio content, okay? So here are some types of audio offers that I personally like to put together. Audio trainings, like single file audio training content, audio-based challenges, where basically it could be five days, it could be a week, and I'm recording the audios of what you need to do on a daily basis and then sending that out to you. Podcasts, so I have a podcast. Well, I have two of them on iTunes, my Sister Sense podcast, my Daily Direction podcast. And you can either have a free podcast or you can monetize it and sell it. There are lots of different audios that you can use to create a digital product and sell. And again, today we're talking about being in that $25 point or even $100 point, okay? So with that being said, do you have an audio-based offer, number one, or can you put one together to focus on this goal? Because honey, in order to make that money, you're gonna have to have something to sell right? So today it's all about me either helping you identify what you have that you can utilize or repurpose. Some of you have a lot of content. I was talking with one of my clients recently and she said to me, Dr. P, she said, well, Shonda, I've got so much content that I can repurpose, right? So if you're like Dr. P, maybe you have resources or content you can repurpose based on the recommendations that I share here, or you've got products you've already put together that you just need to start to proactively sell, right? Um, or you find things that I say that you go, oh, I need to create that. So I actually call this my CUD strategy. And when I say CUD, I mean, what do you have to see, create, U, update, or D, designate more time to focus on and sell, okay? So as I'm saying that, number one, drop into the comment box for me and let me know if any of these resonate with you. Uh, you finding or thinking about right now that you either have to see, create some things, you update some things, or D, designate more time to focus, to sell, 
to really rev up your revenue goals around something that you've already put together. Okay. So awesome to see you guys here. If you're just popping in, like I mentioned before, we're talking about how to make a hundred dollars a day consistently, at least a hundred dollars a day. Okay. And I'm focused on the digital product planner. This is what I'm teaching from today. If you don't have it, you can grab it at sense.com forward slash shop. And if somebody could drop that link into the comment box for me, I would love you for free, for free. <laughs> good morning. Good morning, Facebook user. Beach time. Yes, right? Definitely a boss on the beach conversation today. So I recently put together an audio series. It's called the best seller blueprint. Okay. And I said, listen, I want to talk about the digital products that I sell five types of digital products that I sell that sell like clockwork. Right. And so I created that first when it comes to creating products that I sell that I use to make money. This is my ABC method. Okay. Just lean in. I first start with mapping out what I want to teach, what I want to say, and then I create audio for it. So A, my audio content. And then I dig into B, bundles and books, okay? And then C, I start to do things like challenges, create courses and classes. It takes a little bit more time to do things like courses, right? So when it comes to you doing this in a way that you can quickly execute, because I call this my fast method to QC, QC, quickly create quality content. When it comes to speed, that audio is the way to go because you can verbalize it, record it, bam, put it out, right? So I always start with my audio content. Then I take the time to write books. Some of my books are traditional books or digital eBooks, or even these are low content books. And when I say that I'm, even though this honestly has a lot of content in it, <laughs> this is a big full content, low content, but low content books basically are books where the person who purchases, they are writing in the information. So this is a digital product planner that I put together. So you would be writing in your big ideas, right? You would be mapping out, let me see if I can hit a page here, your product, the name of the product, what type of product, is it audio, is it video, is it a course, is it live, all the things, right? So this is a different type of digital, but also print on demand book. So I always start with A, my audios first, and then I move into B, my books, and then C, I dig into things like creating virtual calls or classes or challenges, and I'll get into the C's in a bit. But the first one is A, audio. So for those of you who are here, do you have audio content or number one, number two, would you like to create some? A great example of that, like I said, is I want to say maybe a week or two ago, I launched the bestseller blueprint at sisterscents.com forward slash BBD for a B bestseller, B blueprint, D download. So over at sisterscents.com forward slash BBD, you will see the bestseller blueprint. It's all about digital products that sell like clockwork. And in that it's written content, but it's a lot of audio training. It's audio content. So one of the ways that I talk about intentionally making at least a hundred dollars a day is having at least one offer to sell and having a very clear price point. As I mentioned before, and I'm going to say this throughout this training, if you've got something for at least $25 for those a day, that's a hundred dollars a day. If you have something for a hundred dollars, one sale a day, that's a hundred dollars a day. Okay. We talked about the money map, crunching those numbers, and we're going to continue to talk about that throughout this live today. Okay. So just checking in to see who is here with me. Do you have that talk about physical products? Um, repeat that link. You went so fast. Oh, awesome. Um, Sista Sense, S I S T A S E N S E dot com forward slash B B D. That's the bestseller blueprint, number one. Um, and everything that I talk about today, I'm going to have examples for, plus the replay at sistersense.com forward slash M100. Um, and if you're looking for the digital planner, that link should be on the M100 page. So sistersense.com forward slash M100. That's probably the only link that I'll focus on sharing today because most of what I talk about, you'll be able to find on that page. Okay. So audio offers being the first 
type of offer that I'm going to share. And I'm going to share with you guys 10 types. I'm all about that 10, 10 win situation, 10 types. Hopefully you can have, you can find some types that you have or that you'd like to create. Jay. He's got his RC car. I, I'm, I'm tempted to see if I could get him to say hi, hi to you guys and jump on the live with me. Okay, so here's another one. How many of you are into affiliate marketing? How many of you are into affiliate marketing? Okay, so if you are not, if you're not familiar, basically affiliate marketing is you promoting other stuff, other people's stuff and making money, right? You sell their stuff, you get a commission from the products. Oh, can you bring me your, your truck? So of course he's the only person on the beach in pants. I don't know if I'm gonna get him sweatpants and sneakers on the beach, okay? No bare feet, no. He's he's doing his RC car thing, which he cannot. Stop, stop the car, stop the car. <laughs> he doesn't come on the beach to be in the sand or in the water. He comes to play with his RCs, okay? So I wanna show this to you because this is an awesome example of what I'm talking about. Um. Affiliate marketing is promoting other people's stuff. And I'm always like, dude, you buy all this stuff, you need to start selling this stuff, right? So <laughs> reselling, promoting these damn trucks is something that is pretty cool, right? To people who love it, because whatever he is, people stop and go, ooh, that's cool, I need to buy that for me, or I need to buy that for my kid, right? So I want you guys to just think about it for a second. You can go back and play. <laughs> oh no! So he goes and starts the car, which proceeds to throw sand all over me. Um, I want you to think about what are some things that either in your business or just overall you love. And whenever people see it, it's like a showstopper. They're like, where did you get that? <laughs> where can I buy that? Right? Affiliate marketing, promote it. So for example, I'm a web designer. And when clients come to me, normally they'll say, okay, LaShonda, I need you to help me build my website. What do I need? And I'll say, okay, well, I can design it for you, number one. But before we get to number one, do you have hosting? And if they go, oh, I don't have hosting, I'll go, okay, well, this is the company that I use. Now, every time someone signs up to the company that I use for me, I generate $65 in revenue. Hello, right? Not from something that I've made, but from referring someone to something that I recommend. Now, I'm going to drop a resource on you guys real quick, okay? It's my Market Build Grow Guide over at sysensecom forward slash M-B-G-G. M-B-G-G stands for Market Build Grow Guide. sysensecom forward slash M-B-G-G. Now, I mentioned to you just a while ago, I have an audio training called the Best Seller Blueprint, right? It's in book format but there are clickable audios in there, A, okay? I mentioned to you now, another A is affiliate marketing, okay? So for those of you who are here, I want you to think about, and even feel free to drop into the comment box for me, either if you are an affiliate, or you can think about things that you should be promoting as an affiliate, okay? <laughs> Everybody, by the way, should have some sort of, at least one or two products that you're connected to as an affiliate, okay? Now, B, books. Books are, really a great way for entrepreneurs to generate rent money okay so this is my book the digital product planner and it's a planner and it is one of my latest good goods you all should be creating content that you can share with your audience the bestseller blueprint book is audio format the market build and grow guide is affiliate links so if you were to go to sysassistance.com forward slash mbgg for the market build grow guide it's an ebook but it's an e-guide because it's affiliate links in there and when people sign up to those resources because i use them i'm like if you want to make a course use this if you want to build your email list use this if you want to create digital products use this the links in there are to things i'm connected to as an affiliate that's what i call gpf GPF, drop that into the comment box for me. GPF, get paid with free. I create free books, digital books with affiliate links and I generate revenue from that. If you need a hosting, use that, right? 
So I'm giving you three types of books so far. The first one is the bestseller blueprint. It's a digital downloaded book, but there are audio links in there. The second one, the market build grow guide. That is a uh, affiliate resource guide. Still an ebook, you download it, but there are affiliate links in there, okay? Number three, I said to you, my digital products planner. This is what we call POD, a print on demand book. So over at sysasense.com forward slash shop, you'll find my shop for my print on demand books. I made the book, I designed the book. These are all the strategies that I've used over the last 20 years to sell digital products and work at home. And ultimately, I put that book up online, creating a Shopify store, okay? This is print on demand. How print on demand works is when you purchase the book, it gets printed and shipped to you. I don't have to print the book. I don't have to ship the book. Once I uploaded my book onto my Shopify store, you go buy it, I make the money, honey, I'm done, okay? <laughs> bam, bam, boom, I'm done, right? So number one, you can create audio-based books, you can create free books with affiliate links, you can create low content books like this, which are planners, workbooks, notebooks, journals. These are LPPs that you can create to generate revenue. By the way, I don't know, and you can let me know if you guys did this. Hey, hey, Andrelia, I see you in the building. Awesome to see you here, my dear. Apologies, y'all, because I'm, I'm leaned like this most of the time, and I'm blind as a bat, so I can't see what you're saying. Okay, so these are examples of LPP, low price point products that you can create to generate revenue, okay? So we talked about A, audio, A, affiliate links, B, books, right? And I shared with you a couple of types of books. Um, if you want, did you guys get the free ebook template yet? Who got the free ebook template? If you got it, let me know. Um, I'd love to see, by the way, what you're using or how you're using the ebook template. So <laughs> share the links with me. If you haven't gotten the free ebook template, go over to what's the best link to give you? Sisasense.com forward slash F E B T. F E B T. So that's the free ebook template. So sisasense.com forward slash F E B T. If you did not get the free ebook template, because literally, if you listen to what I'm sharing with you today, you go grab your template, you make yourself an ebook, whether you put affiliate links in there, okay, or you put some text content and you sell that thing, or you put some audio in there and you link to some information or even video in there, baby, you got an offer to sell. You got an offer to sell. So I'm giving you examples like the Market Build Grow Guide. That's one that has affiliate links. The Bestseller Blueprint, um, that is another one, but that has audio in it, okay? So I talk about five different types of digital products that I sell that sell like clockwork. That's the Bestseller Blueprint. That book has audio content, okay? So I want to make sure that I'm not going too fast. Hey, Rochelle, good morning, good morning. Good evening or good afternoon for those of you who are either international or you're catching me on the replay side, okay? Um, so let me know if you got the free ebook, great, but if you didn't, go grab it. And that is at sisasense.com forward slash F-E-B-T. If somebody could drop that into the comment box for me, I love you for free. <laughs> and I appreciate you, Anissa, for transcribing and popping those things in there. Mwah. I appreciate you for that. Very, very helpful. <laughs> As always. It's been a while since I've been in New York, and the last time I was there, uh, or one of the last times I was there, uh, the lovely Anissa came out and hung out with me. I had a quick little mini workshop, and she drove on over to hang out. So I totally appreciate you for hanging out with me on this beautiful sunny day, boss on the beach style. So, okay. I said to you guys, I'm actually taking you inside of the digital product planner over on sisasense.com forward slash shop. And I so far talked to you about different books. Let me go over to B, books, so that you can see the page. Because each of these pages, I give you at least 10 types of digital products 
And then I explain the tools that I use to create these digital products. So the free template I just talked about is a free template I designed in Canva. So you grab it and you can edit it in Canva. Um, and I'm going to show you how to do that soon enough. Okay, here's the books page. Again, it's really sunny, so apologies if it's not quite easy for you to see, but if you can see it, great. These are different types of books, and then underneath that are tools that I use. So for each digital product, I talk about different types of digital products underneath that main category and things that you can sell. I'm gonna give you 10 of them today, okay? I'll quickly run them down for those of you who are a little bit impatient, because <laughs> I do tend to babble, and then I'll go back to each in detail. So far, we talked about some A's. So we've got audio, we got affiliate offers, A audio, A affiliate offers, B books, B bundles, C calls, C challenges, D downloads, E events, virtual events specifically, E evergreen offers, F freebie offers. So I've got 10 categories that I'm gonna talk about with you guys today. And right now we are on B books, okay? So A audio, A affiliates, B books, B bundles, C calls. You should be doing virtual calls every week, baby, if you wanna generate that revenue. C challenges too. I love to create challenges for my audience. D downloads. Ebooks is a type of download, but it's not the only type, okay? <laughs> I've got like 20 types of downloads to share with you. E, virtual events. How many of you guys are doing virtual events or you wanna start getting into them? I gotta shout out my girl, LaVon, the creator of livevibrantly.com, uh, one of my awesome clients. Last month, we had a clarity call and she said, LaShonda, I am ready to do my first challenge. I'm gonna do it for free. Just kind of want to test it out. I said, baby, even if you test them, you can still make that money, honey. <laughs> so I showed her how to monetize it. So she did do it for free, but she also simultaneously sold the replays, was able to generate sales, knocked out her first five-day challenge, and she's off to the races. And so I definitely want to share different ways that you can generate revenue, challenges C, D downloads, E, virtual events, E, evergreen offers, Evergreen means that you can sell it whenever. It's always going to be fresh, valuable, amazing, irresistible, all the things. And then freebies, as I said before, you need to be GPF getting paid with free, okay? That's something that I do that I want you to be able to do too, okay? Thank you, Anissa, for dropping those links in there. Y'all need to just pay Anissa. <laughs> Give her all the love and all the hearts for popping on here and sharing those links and all the things that I say. <laughs> okay, so let's pause for a second. For those of you who are watching, whether you're watching live or via the replay, and apologies because I don't know, I'm trying to be back here, not by the water, but close to the water, but I kind of want to see what y'all are saying too. So let me know if you either have or you need to create, okay? So remember my acronym, C-U-D. C stands for what you need to create, U, what you need to update so you can start to monetize it and sell it, and then D, what you need to designate more time to promote and sell because you already made it, you're just not pushing it enough, right? I say sometimes y'all ain't selling because you ain't selling. You're not proactively selling your stuff, right? So C-U-D, create, update, designate. First one was audio. Who needs to either create, update, or designate more time to promote audio you've created? Number one, affiliate marketing. Either you need to start creating some affiliate links, updating the ones you have, or designating more time to promote those affiliate links. Number two, B, books. I shared some books on you. I said, who needs to create planners, low content books? Who needs to create audio books? Who needs to be creating these free resource guide books, right? Sharing your affiliate offers. Who needs to be creating books? Now, B number four for me is bundles. Bundles. I call these my BDBs, big, beautiful bundles. I love to create bundles. Gives people a lot of bang for their buck. So when it comes to creating digital offers, I mentioned to you that I have what I call my ABCs, my ABC method. And if you're just jumping on, say, hey, let me know who you are and where you are. 
my ABC method is I start with audios first because it's fastest to record. And I wish I could show you, Jay, but I, if I move this, I'm afraid if I move my phone, I won't be able to get it back the way I want it to. <laughs> he would be like, why are you recording me? Okay, you know what? Bump that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to uh, move around so I can show you a little bit of the water. Let's pause for a second. Get the water pretty. So you a little bit of water. I'm gonna get up and show you, Jay. He's looking at me. He's looking at me like, what is she doing? As you guys see my nostrils. Apologies. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can show you, Jay. So they're setting up like all of these Cabana things, the Ferris wheel. Have y'all, I'm, I'm sure a lot of y'all have been to Myrtle Beach. Have y'all gone to the Ferris wheel? It's like all the way down there. I'm tempted to do the Ferris wheel tonight. All right, okay. So I can't walk very fast and I don't have on my glasses, but Jay is, there goes the car. Where goes Jay? Okay, the car just sped past me. Where goes Jay? Okay, I think the car's gonna come past again. He's not gonna come. There's no way I'm gonna get Jay to get on a live with me. <laughs> okay, I know y'all are here from training. Let me not leave my iPad and my money and all my good goods where I can't see it. Somebody go grab all my stuff. I wanna show you Jay and not just me. Okay, I see an old lady eyeing my stuff. <laughs> okay, he's somewhere here. I don't know if you can see him. <laughs> Come into the live. <laughs> Come into the live. <laughs> you see how bad he is? I want him to be on the live and he's running away from me. I'm not trying to get hot out here. I need to be cute for the camera. So, no. I'm not going to run after him. <laughs> okay. Let's see. I need to wrap this up. I need to do this thing for y'all in the next 20 minutes and wrap this bad boy up so you can enjoy your day and I can enjoy my day too. Plus, I don't need to, it to be hot as Hades out here. Okay, so let me show you my little setup. Okay, so, whew. okay, so that's my little setup right here. Now I'm going to try to put this bad boy back down and get it at the right angle, or at least the, the best possible angle that I can. Hey, Jewel, the sky wheel. Yeah, is that what it's called? I'm just like, I'm thinking of going there later tonight. Every time we come, I never go. Run! <laughs> My old lady legs, I ain't running nowhere. Someone actually got in my chair. Oh no! Okay, see, I got sand all over my hands. All right, y'all, we gonna get back at it. As promised, as promised. Um, and then I have my bag of clothes because as I create videos, I switch out my shirts, all the things. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, Lord, I think I'm gonna get a lot of sand in these locks. Bundles. Do you have or do you need to create bundles? So I said to you, my ABC trick is first I create my audio content, then I create my books, and then I create things like challenges or classes, either recorded or live, like we're doing now, classes. And then I create these big behind bundles, juicy bundles. That allows me to increase the profit per sale. So let's say, for example, you were to go over to let me see, what's a good place to send you? 
Aha, write this down. P-Y-P-B. There goes J. There goes J. <laughs> Can I switch? Can I turn it? Can I show you? Can you say hi? Okay, he said he's going to say hi. Hold on, hold on. Say hi. <laughs> Wave some more. <laughs> so only Jay goes on the beach in pants, sneakers, and stunner shades because stunting like his daddy. <laughs> no swimwear for Jay. I think I'll actually get in some swimwear tomorrow. I won't do it on live because I want to scare y'all, but <laughs> I might do that tomorrow. Okay, back at the bundle. See, I tell you, I babble, and that's what turns these lives into like five-hour sessions. Um, so once I create my audio, then I create the book, and then I make the big old bundles, okay? Um, if Yes, I so told you I was going to send you to a link. Sister Sense dot com Ooh. police popo something's going on on the beach hopefully nothing crazy p y p b p y p b okay so if you were to go over to sister sense dot com that's me s i s t a s e n e dot com forward slash p y p b you'll see the print your profits bundle now the bundle has two levels there is the opportunity for you to just get one amazing template or get the whole kit and caboodle. So there's the 100 page ebook template, which by the way, is the template that I use to create all the good good that I've been sharing with you today. So whether it's a free affiliate guide or an ebook or a print books, I wish I had some of my print books. Like I made it a size, it's a square book and I print out physical copies as well. So I use that bad board for everything. Okay, so you can get that one. It's 100 pages or you can get all the templates. There's a magazine template. The planner template is what I use to create this. So when you get your template, you'll probably see a cover that looks like this. <laughs> so basically, my templates are me giving you access to the same designs because I'm a web and graphics designer. The same designs that I use to create my own stuff. You can create yours. Okay, so. Um, there's the magazine template, the planner template, workbook template, notebook template. Um, blah, 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 blah. There are lots of templates in there. I can't remember all of them. But anyway, my point is it's a bundle, okay? So I want you to think about either do you have or can you put together a bundle, okay? And then also, not only that, when you look at that page, sistersense.com forward slash PYP B for print your profits bundle. That's what PYPB stands for. Print your profits bundle. You'll see there are options, right? So there's a $25 offer and then there's a $100 offer. Remember, I said to you, we crunch the numbers. Do y'all have this, by the way? I don't know if you ordered your digital product planner. I said to you, if you have a $25 offer, you just need four sales a day to average $100 a day. If you have $100 an offer, you need one sale, one sale a day, and you're off to the races, okay? And so today I'm giving you 10 different offers because my goal is that you can come up with at least one or two of these to be your one. I don't know if you've ever heard the acronym, my one, which is basically, it's not an acronym. Acronym is a bad word, a bad word to use. Basically, you take the word money, which is M-O-N-E-Y, and if you play with the letters a little bit, you actually can get my one. I don't know where I heard that, but I heard it years ago. And I love it because the idea is, if you wanna make money, then find my one. Find that one thing, at least the one thing that you can do to generate revenue, right? And so my goal is to share 10 with you so you can 10, 10 win. <laughs> You can find at least one that works for you. So can you put together a bundle? Either you have one or you can potentially put one together, okay? So for those of you who are watching me, let me know. Either you have or you are thinking about either putting together A, an audio offer, maybe 
number another A is affiliates an affiliate offer sharing affiliate links um, another one working on some books I gave you a bunch of books print on demand books low content books um, ebooks audiobooks free books with affiliate offers a bundle maybe you have one or you can potentially put together some sort of bundle now there are different types of bundles you can put together so let's go to the book let's refer to the book let me go to the bundles page and I'll try to share as many of these pages with you on camera. I'm not really good at that, to be honest with you, but I'm not good at um, showing you these pages on camera, but I will try. There are 20, 21 types of digital products I have in here. Okay, here we go, bundles. So, I don't know how well you can see that, but there are 10 different types of bundles. And then at the bottom, I talk about the different tools that I use to create my bundles, okay? So I'm gonna give you verbally a few really easy examples of bundles, okay? So let's say you create a simple bundle, which would be a digital book bundle where you have two or more books. So how many of you already have digital books? If you do, then literally you can put a bundle together today, okay? Another one is an audio bundle, multiple audios. Bam, bam, boom, there you go. Another one is a product bundle, where basically it has different parts of your product and you're bundling it all together. So let me explain with this right here. The digital product planner is to me, honestly, a product bundle because number one, gives you this bad boy. You get the actual digital product planner. Number two, I'm actually, for those who purchase the digital product planner within the next week, because I've newly launched it for my birthday, it's one of my newest good goods. You purchase the planner within the next week, you'll get a printable planner as well. Because obviously it may take you a few days to actually get this in the mail and some people can't wait. So I wanna make sure that you have a printable product planner as well with that bundle. But immediately when getting your planner, there is a link in here to access a video training as well as audio training as well. So there's the planner itself, there's a printable version, there's the audio training, there's the video training, and it's all around the same theme, which is creating digital products, right? So I want you to think about that. Can you create, see, you update, your old content to repurpose it, or D, designate some time to promote a bundle that you've already put together, okay? C-U-D. Okay. So y'all good, y'all are quiet. <laughs> are you writing notes? Are you watching? I see you, but y'all are quiet right now. I just, I'm just curious. Uh, if, you're getting, if you're getting something from this, let me know, okay? It's still early. It's still early. I'll probably be on for about another 15 or 20 minutes and then wrap up and go have breakfast. But want to make sure that you guys are getting value out of today's session. So as you pop into the chat box for me so that I can see, the next one here that I want to share with you is C calls. So every week, I have clarity calls with clients on Wednesdays. Those are my office hours. And I believe that every entrepreneur should have a platform they're using for people to easily book and get on the phone and talk to you, either over the phone or over the computer. So virtual calls is another thing that you can sell, okay? So literally, um, I'm doing a lot of awesome promotions right now because it's the holiday weekend and it's my birthday. So I've been giving away gifts and all these things. Um, I'm doing 30 minute, $30 calls for those who are interested in getting on the phone and talking to me one-on-one. -on -one. My 30 minute calls are usually start, they usually start at 100 and my 60 minute calls usually start at 200. So I'm doing $30 calls today and then that goes away. Um, and that's over at sense.com forward slash exclusive because it's an exclusive offer. If you get there and it's not there anymore, opportunities expire. What can I tell you? <laughs> right? Um, but everyone here should have a platform on which they are in a space where 
you got information up here and people want to pick your brain, right? And as they say, you can pick my brain long as that invoice gets paid, right? Um, and so right now, I'm just doing this promotion right now for the holiday, like I said, uh, and it's $30 for 30 minutes. So you think about that. Three people sign up, that's 90 bucks, close to $100. Right. The goal is how can you make a hundred dollars a day? You just have to do the math. So let's say four people sign up before I get off this live. That's one twenty, a hundred dollars in an hour. Not bad. Or um, at the regular rate of a hundred dollars. Right. Uh, three people sign up at a hundred dollars. That's three hundred dollars. Right. Um, so there are real ways for you to generate real revenue so long as you are willing to figure out my one, right? At least one offer that can work for you to help you. My one, M-Y-O-N-E, switch it around, generate that M-O-N-E-Y, generate that money, right? Same letters, one concept. My one, my one irresistible offer, having at least one irresistible offer to help you generate that M-O-N-E-Y, that money. So how many of you are doing calls or can do calls? Um, if you go over to my call page, not only will you see that opportunity to get $30, 30 minute calls. Right now I'm doing $60, 60 minute calls. Those are usually 200, but then you'll also see packages. I have call packages that are upwards of a thousand dollars, right? Um, and so creating a space where not only are you creating LPP low price point offers, which for me are offers that are under a hundred dollars, but creating high price point offers that are several hundred, if not several thousand dollars, these are things that you can do to consistently generate revenue, right? So I have a package, it's 1500, somebody buys today, that's like, you know, 15 times more than <laughs> the, the, the goal, which is, you know, that, that $100 a day goal, right? So that's something to think about as well. When it comes to generating revenue, I oftentimes share my equation, which is I make money selling LPPs. I mean, lean in real quick just to see what you guys are saying to me. I make money selling LPPs, low price point products, HPPs, high price point products, OPPs, other people's products, and PIPs, passive income products. Last but not least, NPPs, no price point products. Those free products that I use to either promote my stuff or other people's stuff that generate money, okay? So I got the LPP, low price point, HPP, high price point, OPP, other people's products, PIP, passive income products, NPP, no price point, things that I use to promote my products and other people's offers. Those five help me consistently make that money, okay? Um, and I share that, by the way, in here. In, as part of the money map, um what page is that 1010 10 win crunch the numbers pricing and profit money making method so there's you know there's sections in here for you to work on your products but then there's a lot of a lot of information and audio slash video content for you to learn about the different strategies that I use, right? So those are the, that's basically my equation. Those are the acronyms that go to my, my uh, make money online consistently equation, okay? So C, the next one here for me is challenges, okay? Challenges. So I love to create different types of challenges. Um, I create automated challenges where people get the information via email. I create challenges where I'll say, okay, for the next seven days, I want you to do dot, dot, dot. And then I'll record audio for the daily exercises or video challenges. So right now I'm doing the content creation challenge. Who needs to work on their content? I'm curious if you need to work on your content. Um, if you go to scissorsense.com forward slash exclusive, one of the exclusives is to get the 100 day content challenge for 30 bucks, because right now it's the holiday weekend, so I'm doing a lot of promotions for the holiday. Normally, the 100-day content challenge is just that. It's 100 days, so it's $100. But for that challenge, I do videos, and I'm teaching you in the videos how I create content for my blog, how I create content for social media, how I create content that basically converts into cash flow, right? That converts into new customers. Um, that's what the content challenge is all about. 
So creating challenges, whether they be audio-based, text-based, or video-based, um, creating challenges, whether they be automated, or you just say, here, here's all the challenge, and you just give it to them in that one thing, those are things you can do. So for example, I don't have it with me. Let's pretend this is it. <laughs> here's another one of my planners. This is the 20 minute content plan, which um, was actually one of the trainings I did a part, as part of the 100 day content challenge. Um, I have another planner, it's called I Sell Online. And in that planner, there is a 30 day challenge, uh, the Sisters Who Sell 30 Day Sales Challenge. It's a challenge, but it's in a calendar format. I wish I had it, I'd show it to you. It's in a calendar format and it's got an activity, a sales activity you do every day for 30 days. So I have challenges where I just make simple calendars and I say, here, here's your challenge. Or again, I do audios or as far as content, the content creation challenge, those are videos that I'm doing. There are lots of different ways to do challenges, okay? So let's go back to our book. I feel like I'm doing an episode of Blue's Clues, the handy dandy notebook. <laughs> so one of the pages is in here is the digital product planner. Again, I have 21 types of digital products that I create and I break them down inside of this right here. If you don't have the digital product planner, you can grab it at sistersense.com forward. No, sorry, sistersense.shop. I always want to say .com, but it's not. It's sistersense, S-I-S-T-A-S-E-N-S-E dot S-H-O-P. Okay, that's where you'll find the planners. So here is the page on challenges. And my apologies if you can't see it that great because it's very hard for me to see. It's very sunny out here, as you can tell, but I'm trying my best to show you this page. There are 10 different types of challenges um, that I talk about. So a simple task challenge is basically you giving them one activity, you putting it in some format, whether it be audio, video, or text, and you're like, here's the challenge. I mentioned to you my iSell planner. There's a calendar and all 30 days, it's on one of the pages of the calendar. Or maybe you do an X day challenge, like a five day challenge, like my client LaVon, she just did a five day challenge last month. Or maybe you do 21 days. Um, one of my clients, Liana, we worked on a 30 day detox challenge. She does health and wellness. Um, or like me, a hundred day challenge, right? <laughs> right? So you can have a multi day challenge, right? Um, or maybe you do a live challenge where people have to start at a certain day with you within a group and everyone does the activities every day as part of that experience. So I actually signed up for a seven day live challenge with one of my favorite business besties this month. And uh, it was pretty awesome. So that was done within a group. Not only did the host have live sessions, but she also had a live group just for those of us who are in that challenge. So those are examples of challenges that you can put together. That's number six. Number seven, D is downloads, okay? So I'm gonna talk to you about different types of downloads and share some of my favorites. I have 20 types that I can share with you. I have sand everywhere. So I'm just kind of like, Thank you for your consistency. That's my biggest problem. Hey, Andrea, consistency is key. Consistency is key, right? And I definitely want to help you with that. Um, so I created Run Your Business Like a Boss because one of my clients last week, we were on a clarity call and she said, you know what, LaShonda, I need to know what to do. I need to work on my routines. So the Run Your Business Like a Boss planner I talk about seven things you should be doing every single week and you have space to basically map those things out, right? So one of the things I do is sessions. I have sessions, whether they be one-on-one -on -one sessions or virtual group sessions. Uh, every week I work on sales because that's important, right? Proactively selling. I always say, listen, you ain't selling because you ain't selling, right? If you're not actually making sales and making money, it's because you're not actually selling the things that you offer, right? So I have seven daily routines and that's a part of the run your business like a boss planner consistency is king no wait 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 content is king 
Consistency is queen. Put them together to collect them coins, right? <laughs> Consistency is definitely key. It's queen in my book and hopefully your book too. So D, downloads. I've got quite a few things that I love to offer to people as downloads, as you can tell. I love to offer eBooks, audio training, because I'm not always about getting cute and in front of the cameras. Half the time my hair is a hot mess, so you don't see me in front of the camera all the time. So th now that you're seeing me live for these couple of days, soak it in. Like these sun rays, this vitamin D that I'm soaking in right here, <laughs> soak it all in, because it might be a while before you see me like this again. Um, I love to do audio content, audio files that people can download, um, templates. I absolutely love templates. Did you get the free ebook template yet? If you didn't go get it, because if you want to do some of the things that I'm sharing with you today, you can use the easy ebook template to get started. And that again is at sense.com forward slash F E B T F E B T for free ebook template. So sense.com forward slash F E B T. So I love to give away, or rather, I love to create and share eBooks, audios, free guides. I mentioned to you the Market Build Grow Guide. It's a free resource at sense.com forward slash MBGG. MBGG for Market Build Grow Guide. It's a great example, number one, of an eBook that I created using the template that I gave you for free. <laughs> but it's a great example of something that helps me generate revenue through affiliate money that it's free. It's a free resource with affiliate links in it to things that I use to grow and maintain my business, right? Um, it's also a great example of D, a downloadable offer. So free guides, workbooks, templates, eBooks, audios. Those are five examples of things you can download. Um, and let me go to the downloads page in this book real quick. Okay, I found it pretty easy. I'm gonna run through all of these with you right quick because I'm sure you can't see them on this, on the downloads page. Maybe you can, I don't know. Maybe your eyesight is better than mine. Um, so we've got digital product ideas, eBooks, audiobooks, coloring books. Uh, one of my clients, LaVon, she is the creator of livevibrantly.com. Definitely check her out. She's got some beautiful affirmation cards. I love them. They're right on my mantle. Um, she has an adult coloring book that she recently released. Log books and trackers. Oh my gosh, I don't have it. I have a new password book for those of you who can never remember your passwords. Log books and trackers. Planners, whether they be print or digital planners. Worksheets, cheat sheets, templates fonts. Some of you are graphic designers like myself. Maybe you have your own fonts. Guides and reports. Printable cards. Uh, one of my clients, Tiffany, she has a relationship coaching website and she created these beautiful relationship cards. They're printable and we worked on her putting them up on the Etsy platform for sale. Uh, so printable cards, definitely awesome. Checklists, spreadsheets, forms, software and apps, audio files, swipe files, photos and art for those of you who are digital creatives, videos. So that's just a, a quick list of some of the downloadable things that you can potentially put together and turn into revenue. I shared my top five with you as well as the 20. Just a quick rundown of the ones that are here in the digital product planner. Okay. Woo. Okay, so I've got three more to share with you before I finish up this session today, okay? <laughs> Feel free to number one, tag a business bestie. Number two, tell me if you're learning anything today. I don't know if this is helpful to you, but if you've learned anything, if you're gonna try one of these things to work on your profit plan, feel free to share that with me as well. And as I mentioned before, this is the M100 Make $100 a Day Challenge. The replay to this, the examples to all of the things that I'm sharing with you, as well as the digital planner too, you can get access to those things at sense.com forward slash M100. So M100, okay? So if you can't track all the things and all the links that I'm saying, just go to sense.com forward slash M100. Uh, and you'll be able to see all the good good there. Um, and 
you can also send me a voice message when you're there. When you're there on the sisterdance.com website, you can click that gray tab on the right to send me a voice message if you want to talk to me, um, and I can talk to you too, okay? So lots of sand everywhere, just kind of navigating that. Hey, Rochelle. Come in and thumbs up, please. She is sharing great information. Oh, thank you, Rochelle. Mwah. I appreciate you for that, my dear. Totally appreciate you. Okay, so D is downloads. E is events. So I do a lot of events. And I haven't put my hats on. So I'm doing lots of videos right now, right? So I have the blue hat and I have the tan hat. Maybe I'll rock this one for a little bit. I think I was rocking the blue one yesterday. Or maybe it's hard to see me when I've got this hat on. I don't know. <laughs> so I do a lot of events like this live stream that I'm doing with you guys right now. All right. Uh, using, by the way, the StreamYard platform. I'm going to drop a tool on you. Okay. Love StreamYard. Uh, it's one of my favorites. You can go to sisterscents.com forward slash SY if you want to get a StreamYard trial. Pretty cool. I'm simultaneously broadcasting across YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. So it's definitely helping me, and I'm doing all of this from my iPhone. So it's an awesome tool. I can use it in my office, and I can use it mobily on the beach. Pretty freaking cool. Okay. So events. If you want to make that money, honey, I talk about weekly webinars, weekly webinars. That's one thing that I do. Number one. Number two, weekend workshops. So there are times when I will schedule virtual workshops for usually a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Sometimes I'll do two days, but I usually do three days. Quarterly conferences. So having multiple speakers come on. Seasonal summits. So having an audio-based summit. These are a few types of virtual events that you can consider, okay? So I'm going to kind of lean in so I can see what you guys are saying and popping into the chat. <laughs> can you hear me well, by the way? I know that there's a lot going on on the beach, and you can probably hear the waves crashing, crashing in. So hopefully the audio is not bad. I did not bring, like, a mic with me. I'm just kind of flying by the seat of my pants. The children are here. <laughs> Christopher, do you want to say hi? I'm on a live. Do you want to say hi? Sure. <laughs> I did it. I got him out. You got him out? Yes. Lean down. Lean down. This is my sister-in-law. Hi. <laughs> and Christopher, come and say hi. Come and say hi. Come, <laughs> come and say hi. Come on. Where's the dog? She needs to go pee. You need to go get her and then bring her back. Back. Uh, come down. Say hi. <laughs> come down and say hi. Move, move, move the locks out of your face so they can see that you're a real boy, like Pinocchio. You're a real boy. Yes, you are. Give your mother some love. <laughs> Pretend like you love me on camera, please. People are watching. Give me some love. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no. Can you bring the dog down for like two seconds and uh, let her pee? And then you can take her back upstairs. What's oil? I'm sorry. You're fine. I'm sorry. I thought you would know that she needed to pee. We bought the dog, the whole family. <laughs> and I'll be right back here next month. I'm scheduled another one of these Myrtle Beach trips. So, okay. As I digress. Um, these are some kinds of events that you can do. Like I said, every page in here has different types of digital offers. I love to do virtual events. And I also talk about some great tools. StreamYard is one of them. That's what I'm doing to live, using to live stream right now. When I do my live or pre-recorded webinars, I use the Start Meeting platform. Absolutely love Start Meeting. Right now, I am doing my content creation challenge. 
and I'm creating trainings for that. It's a hundred day experience. I'm actually challenging myself to write a hundred articles in a hundred days and we are in the 60s space. Uh, so I'm creating videos for that and I'm using the Loom platform, L-O-O-M platform to create the videos that I do in a combination with Canva. So when it comes to hosting a virtual events, Start Meeting, Loom, Canva, StreamYard, these are some of the platforms that I use a lot. Um, now, as I mentioned before, in the Content to cash flow Digital Product Planner, um, definitely get it, because like I said, it's very meaty, it's very beefy, there's a lot of stuff in here. Let me go over to the ease, which we are on now, for events. And again, I'll try to pop this onto the screen so that you can see. I talk about the different types of events. I've got 10 for each category. And then I talk about the different tools that I use. And I'm verbally sharing some of this stuff with you because obviously I don't know how much of this you can actually see when I show it to you on the screen. But as you go through each of these 21 types, there are 10 subtypes for each. So that gives you a total of 210 possibilities. And then there is space for you to work on your big ideas. There's also space for you to work on your digital products, mapping out, you know, what you're going to call it, when you're going to release it, um, mapping out, you know, what kind of product it is, whether it's physical or dis digital audio or video. This is just to kind of give you a visual of the kind of pages that you'll have in here. And then there's the money map. There's a section on really getting clear about your money goals and your profit and your pricing goals, as well as the audio and video and printables that come with the planner. So it's a very beefy planner um, over at citizens.shop. So hosting events pretty much on a weekly basis is one of the ways I'm able to consistently generate revenue, okay? Making that $100 a minimum a day. Are you hosting events, okay? So I said to you, one of my acronyms is CUD. You wanna think about what you can either create, what you need to update, or maybe you just need to designate more time to focus on things that you've already developed. So you can drop a C, a U, or a D in the comment box for me so that I can see what you're gonna work on. Because it's not just about me verbally sharing these things, but about you intentionally coming up with an action plan today. That's what today is all about, okay? So there are different types of events that I do. Some of them are one time. Some of them are seasonal events. Um, I also do subscription based events. So I have my mastermind and my mastermind is two webinars a month, every other Tuesday. So I think the next one is coming up next week, if I'm not mistaken. Right. Um, so having a subscription based offer that you do as a webinar or an event, I also said to you that this weekend, I'm doing $30 clarity calls over at sisterscents.com forward slash call me. I'm doing $30, 30 minute calls and $60, 60 minute calls. Usually those calls are upwards of $100. Um, and so I'm doing a, like a weekend holiday promotion. So I'm always doing events, whether they be private, intimate, in-person, virtual events, okay? Um, I dropped a few examples on you, webinars, whether you do them weekly or you do a, like a three day or a weekend webinar, um, conferences where it's you and you've got other speakers too, whether they be virtual conferences or seasonal summits, th those are a few things you can do, okay? So next thing that I wanna share with you is evergreen offers. Okay, so evergreen offers are basically offers that are not time specific. So if I say to you, I want you to participate in my content to cash flow content creation challenge. I'm actually recording the content right now because I'm doing 100 days, right? Even though I'm recording the content right now in real time, it's an evergreen training. Why? Because you can start today. And if you start today, you're going to start on day one, right? Evergreen means you can sell it at any time and no one's going to miss anything or it's not dated. Like, let's say I decided to do a workshop today and I'm like, this is the how to make money during Memorial Day weekend workshop. It's specifically about making money during Memorial Day weekend. It's very time specific. 
um, unless I sell you the replays, it's more like, it's not necessarily a evergreen offer, right? Um, evergreen offers, like I said, are basically offers that you can sell anytime and there's no date on it. I could sell these all year long, right? It's evergreen. So you want to create more content that sells for you on any given day, any given Sunday, <laughs> right? Um, I was working with a client on her automated challenge and I said to her, okay, so how do you want to do this? We could do this two ways, live or evergreen. So she opted for live. So she wants people to sign up at a specific date and go through the challenge with her within a group for 30 days. Okay. That would be a live experience. Evergreen is that you already create the content. They get it automatically and it doesn't matter whatever day they sign up is when they sign up and automatically the information gets to them, right? That's an example of evergreen content. Okay. Something else that you should be creating. So again, one of the things that I mentioned about my digital product planner is that it is POD, a print on demand offer. So let me give you a little bit of backstory. I create digital products. I sell online. I teach y'all. I also am a graphics and web designer. So I write, wrote down my information. I said, okay, well, how do I sell digital? I documented my process. You guys want to teach, you want to make money with your information, document your process, what you do, how you do it, what you use, what works for you, sit down and write it out. I did that. Hence this, I went into Canva. I have several templates that I created. Okay. This is my planner template that I use to create this one. I have an ebook template, planner template, magazine template, newsletter template, workbook template, notebook template. I got a lot of templates. Okay. I use my template and I made this. So start off with writing out your idea, free 99. I used Google docs, documented my process. Step two, went to Canva, used the template that I designed in Canva. If you want my template, just go to scissorsense.com forward slash PYPB. PYPB stands for the print your profits bundle. Okay. Right now it's at a reduced rate because it's the holiday season and I'm doing a lot of promotions this weekend, but then it's going up. <laughs> uh, Cause there's a lot of stuff in there. It's like a thousand dollars plus worth of templates and training that I've put in there for like 95 bucks. I'm crazy, but whatever. Um, after I wrote in Google Docs my content, I went into Canva, used the template, designed my planner. This planner, by the way, is currently 132 or 36 pages, okay? It's beefy, it's a nice beefy planner. I went into Google Drive and made sure that the links to what I want you to get access to are in Google Drive. I have video that you can watch. When I put video in my content, there are three ways that I do it. Number one, I can upload my video to YouTube. When I upload to YouTube, I unlist it so it's not searchable in the public and only people who pay can get access to it. Number two, Vimeo. If you don't want to use YouTube, Vimeo is another platform. You create your videos, you upload it to Vimeo. Number three, Wistia. Wistia is the big boy. So if you want that real premium look and feel, you got to pay for it, honey. But Wistia would be the big boy of uploading your video content. Unless you are using like a course platform that you directly upload to that platform. For me, some of the more cost effective solutions, it's free 95 to upload your videos and unlist it on YouTube. Then you've got something like Vimeo, which is an alternative. Not everybody likes the video player on YouTube. I'm fine with it. But then there's Vimeo as an alternative to YouTube. And then you can pay a little bit, but you get a highly crisp quality player and style um, and just a few other bells and whistle features with a platform like Wistia. Okay. So, um, I upload my videos to YouTube. I upload my audios to Dropbox. I pop the links into the book. So I'm like, Hey, now that you got your book, go listen to your audios, go watch your videos, go get your resources. I tell you where to go. The link in the book. Okay. That's how I create my content. That's how I create the content as far as my process is concerned. Evergreen, I sell this on Shopify. I don't know how many of you have stores. I have different stores for different things. 
if you go to sisasense.com forward slash books, my website is built on WordPress and I use WooCommerce for that. Sisasense.com forward slash books. My e-commerce store that I absolutely love that I've been using since 2013 is over at sisasense.com forward slash e s o. Uh, it's my e store. It's my old G e store because that's how old it is. So I call it e s o. Sisasense.com forward slash e s o. I use Selves for that platform. Unfortunately, Selves is closing. Amazon bought them. Urgh. And they're closing sales next month, which is why I'm doing a closeout. So everything in my store right now is basically 60% off over at sisasense.com forward slash ESO. One of my clients was like, oh my God, your store is closing. Are you leaving us? And I'm like, girl, I ain't going nowhere. <laughs> it's just that uh, sales got bought over by Amazon and for whatever reason, they're closing it. So um, by the way, those of you who have sales and you're like, where are you going to go? What are you going to do? Um, Shopify is a good alternative. PayHip is another one. And WooCommerce is another one. Just for those of you who have sales and you're looking for other platforms to use. So I use sales, number one, over at sisasense.com forward slash ESO. My Shopify store is sisasense.com forward slash, no, sisasense.shop. I always screw that up. My Shopify store is sisasense.shop. And uh, my WooCommerce store is sisasense.com forward slash books just so if you could see the differences between them, if you want to, okay? Um, I'm a web designer, so they're like chips. I can make as many of these damn things as I want. Okay. <laughs> Some folks, you gotta find somebody and pay somebody like me to do it. I don't gotta pay nobody because I do it for me, okay? Um, but just if you wanted to see those, or if you had questions, feel free to ask me. This is print on demand. I sell it on Shopify. You go and you order it, it gets shipped out to you. All I needed to do was write my stuff. I did that in Google Docs, put all my audios on Dropbox, all my videos on YouTube, all my files on Google Drive, linked everything in my book, downloaded my Canva book as a PDF, connected my PDF to Shopify. I'm using print on demand. So you buy it, it gets automatically shipped out to you. I make my revenue. I'm off to the races. It's an evergreen offer, okay? I was actually on a call with one of my clients, Miss Turquoise Blue, shouting you out. Um, she said, LaShonda, I want to set up my Shopify store and start selling my print-on-demand products and my digital products on Shopify. So we did a 90-minute session last week to do that. So uh, outside of doing these with you guys as a group, I also work with clients one-on-one -on -one and help them set things up, okay? So I want to be able to be just fully not even transparent, but just step by step walk you through. Most of the stuff that I use is free 99. Now, I spend like less than 20 bucks a month on Canva. Google Workspace, I think is like $6 or something crazy like that. I really spend no money on Google Workspace. And Google Drive is free. You get Google Workspace if you want to get some premium features or extra space, right? But for less than 100 bucks a month, right? You can use these tools. Uh, I use Canva for my templates, like I said, YouTube, Dropbox. These are some of the tools that I use. All of the tools that I use for my digital products are in this planner. If you have any questions for me, feel free to pop them into the chat. If you've gotten anything out of today, I would love to know what you've learned. Feel free to pop that into the chat too, so I can check in with you, okay? Any questions or any comments about what you've gained from today? The last thing that I said to you is freebie offers. Okay, freebie offers. You need to create some freebies that you can convert into revenue. I always talk about GPF, get paid with free. Get paid with free content. I'm doing a live stream today for y'all. This is absolutely free. It's absolutely free. I'm making money. I'm making money. I'm going to finish this live, go eat some breakfast. I don't know where my son is with my dog. Hey, Bri Bri, call Chris to find out where he is. It's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah. Is he out here with her? I thought he would, would bring her over here because I wanted to see her. Call her and, well, call him and see where he is. And if he's still out here, tell him to bring Prince to me. Gotta make sure my mini-me is 
intact. <laughs> so anyway, freebie offers, right? So this live stream is free that I'm doing with y'all. It's an educational opportunity for me to drop a lot of great resources on you. But one of the things that I do is I sell and tell. Sell and tell is the strategy that I documented and defined several years ago. And basically, it basically means that I tell you what you can do, right? And then I also share with you the resources that I use and the resources that I create to help you do the things I'm telling you to do, right? This is my sell and tell strategy, right? Um, but it's worked for me all these years. So as they say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Um, I give away free stuff all the time. I have my latest issue of Sister Sense Magazine. If you don't have it, you can get it for free. Did you get your template? Over at sistersense.com forward slash exclusive. I have some exclusive opportunities. You can get a $30, 30 minute call with me, number one. You can get a free five page ebook template, number two, to do some of these activities that I'm sharing with you. You can even get the latest issue of Sister Sense Magazine for free. Did he pick up? Tell, it, tell him to bring her down for me. She needs to get cute for the camera. Sorry, side conversation. <laughs> um, so I give away free eBooks, free magazine issues, free templates, free clarity calls. Um, also promote things like my, he's coming? Yeah, Jay was with him. Oh, Jay was with him. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> daddy was with him. <laughs> fighting off anyone who might take him. <laughs> Never mind, he's five foot eight. So he towers over me now. There comes my baby. I don't mean the boy, I mean my dog. <laughs> <laughs> my pretty man, cinnamon. So do you have freebies or can you create them? So number one, do you have freebies? If you do, let me know what your freebie offers are. Do you have freebies that are making you money? I'm gonna share with you a freebie funnel right now. How it works, how I created it, I'm gonna rock it out and share that with you guys right now. Hopefully my live keeps on keeping on for me. If you're quiet, say hello, let me know who you are. <laughs> Pop into the chat. If I can't see you, my apologies. Hey Monique, good morning, good morning. Awesome to see you here, my dear. If I can't see your comments, I'll comment after the live is over because some of them I'm not seeing. Um, but if you can chat, say hey, okay? Um, I'm going to give you a freebie funnel in just a second, but I first wanted to check in with you guys and see if you do have freebies. Um, and if not, why not? Let's go over, before I get to the freebie funnel, let's go in our handy nandy dandy book. That's our blues clues moment for the day, right? Um, I just talked to you about evergreen offers. Did I share that page? I don't think so. So here's the page and the digital products planner on evergreen offers. And I share 10 types of evergreen offers plus tools that I use to create them. So there are 21 types of digital products in here. So each has 10 types. We do the math 21 times 10. That's 210 possibilities of digital products that you can potentially put together. Okay. Let's go over to the freebie offer conversation situation. Freebie offers. I will verbally share what these freebies are in just a second. Hey, Tracy. Awesome to see you here, my dear. Um, I'm going to talk about freebies and I'm going to tell you some freebie examples in a second. And then I saw him and then he left. I am loving this breeze, y'all. This breeze is... Can we pause for a second just to appreciate the breeze of the situation, the breeziness? Um, let me see what y'all are saying. Hey, Tracy. Okay, let's see here. You say you're having trouble just following through on the content. So many templates I have, but really finishing the interior. Okay, so I got you, I got you. 
here's something that I can share with you that is very intentional, okay? So one of my clients, LaVon, she said to me, LaShonda, I'm going to work on my planners. She said this to me in January last year, right? She's one of my OG business besties. And for about three, four months, all we did, she and I, we went into the templates that she got from your girl and we worked on her planners. Funny enough, we just updated one of them last week. So she picked one thing, we ran with it. One of my other clients, Katoya, she does quite a few things. She is an awesome creative. She does crochet, number one. She has her own beauty care line, Womology, number two. She does homeschooling, number three. Beautiful spirit. She said, LaShonda, I want to see more black and brown homeschooling resources. For a couple of months, we focused on her creating unit study homeschooling resources for teachers and parents. Right now, First of all, mind you, let's just give a shout out to me because I haven't been on live all year and I've been knocking out these lives for the last three days, right? That's number one. Hold on, here they come. Hi, Brittamin. Hi, Mama. Brittamin is here. Brittamin has officially entered the building. Say hi. You can let her walk on the sand for a bit and then you can take her back inside because I know you want to relax. Huh? I don't have a key now. You don't I have a my, key? I gave mine to dad. He just needed it. Then he's upstairs. Yeah. Okay, so just take her upstairs. Do you want my key? No, I don't know. You can take my key if you want my... No, uh What do you want me to do? You can let her walk on the sand for a bit and hang out and then you can take her back upstairs. My babies. Okay. So. You, your lives have been awesome. Whew. We had some hard days sometimes. <laughs> We've had some hard days sometimes, but doesn't everybody, right? I don't think anybody's life is easy, but I do think that when you just kind of stay focused, you can make it happen. You can make anything happen. So one of the things that I want to share with y'all is I said to myself, I haven't been blogging in a while, right? They're back there doing all their things. Let me check in with y'all in, in a way where I'm not... <laughs> I'm trying to find a way to be in the shot without having them in the shot doing their swimming things. Are they swimming? What are they doing? No, they're just hanging out with Bryn. Okay. Um, I said, you know what, LaShonda, it's been a while since you blogged. So I decided to write 100 blogs in 100 days. I'm in the day 60 now. That's what I'm doing right now. Write 100 blogs in 100 days because that was my focus. I haven't done a live in a long time. I, I think these are the first live streams that I'm doing with you guys in months. And I always say, listen, I don't jump on the social scene to be seen. I don't got time for that. I'm old. I'm tired. I want to take a nap. I want to go to sleep. I don't want to twerk for TikTok. <laughs> I don't want to, you know, twerk for coins. No, but I'm very intentional. So um, I did well over 100 days no, I did a year. I did a little over a year's worth of live stream every single day for well over a year. So what's my point here? For the person who just said, I struggle with consistency. Me too. <laughs> the magic in what I do and what I offer to my clients is that we pick a project and we focus on that damn thing. In spurts. When I was in high school and we did track, I was not about that track life, but I could sprint like nobody's business. I do things in these little sprints <laughs> and I kind of go and focus on that thing and knock it out, right? I gave myself a deadline. They say a dream, what is it? A goal, 
what is it? A dream? What is it? I know what I want to say a dream with a wish with a deadline. A goal is a dream, a wish with a deadline. I don't know. Somebody look it up. It's like a goal is a wish with a deadline or a dream with a deadline or something like that. I set deadlines for myself. I set specific goals, very specific, and then I work towards them. So this is my birthday weekend. My birthday just passed this Thursday. And I said, I need to finish my planners, okay? Full transparency. I had launched five planners in my shop. A few of these I had visions of two, a year ago, two years ago, doing a bunch of other things, not finishing them. I got quiet, I got clear, I sat down, I finished them. One of my clients said to me, girl, I ain't heard from you in weeks. What's going on? I said, girl, I ain't, I'm here. <laughs> I'm doing private calls. I know I ain't on social media, but I'm sending out emails. I'm making my money. You don't got to be on social media all the time to be making money, right? You could just be doing your thing, working with your people, making your money. But a part of that was outside of helping clients with their web projects or doing website designs, I was sitting down and finishing my, my planner. This one, this is the digital product planner. This one is the 20 minute content plan. I have five of these and I have the perfect password book for people who need password log books because I sat down, I got quiet and I got selfish. Who needs to get selfish right now? Like, I mean, seriously, you need to set your damn deadline. You need to stop telling me or other people that you're too busy. You don't have time to work on your stuff because everybody else is taking up your time. You need to lock yourself in a room. You need, to, you need to be selfish. You need to get your stuff done. You want to make that money, honey? Then you got to prioritize you. Prioritize your priorities. Set very specific things that you choose to do and knock them out. I gave myself the deadline of finishing these planners and making them available for purchase by my birthday. I'm born on May 26th. My girl Pam Perry, y'all know Pam? If you know Pam, tag her. Tag Pam, shout her out. Um, my girl Pam Perry, she's also born on May 26th. We're 20 years apart. She turned 62, I turned 42. And so I said, Pam, girl, she was like, what you, what you up to? I said, well, I'm printing out some stuff. I'm doing my prints on demand right now. She was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, I got my box today. My planners came. So I unboxed my planners on my birthday. There's no better gift than you can give yourself than the gift of actualizing your vision, living your dream, creating the things that you want to create. And I got selfish. Somebody put, get selfish. Get selfish. Because <laughs> that's what you got to do. Some of that consistency, some of that struggle, I guarantee you, is that you prioritize everybody else and your plate is full because you're doing stuff for everybody else when you should be doing more stuff for you, number one. Number two, I guarantee it's because you are talking yourself out of your greatness. All the things that you keep wanting to do, you keep talking yourself out of it. And let me tell you, distractions, I ain't going to go into it because I need to get back to this training and wrap up. I've gone through so many crazy distractions in the last month that sent me to tears, that, that sent me to saying, you know what, I'm about to close up shop, <laughs> get myself a tiny home, live in an RV, and call it quits. Me and Prince, and she knew I was about to talk to her, because this year, me and my damn dog in an RV tiny home traveling the world. I said, this boy, he about to be 18. No, he's he about to be 16. But look, two years, he's out. Oh, wait. I let Prin go. Wasn't holding her leash. She was about to say, Lord, take me now. Just run straight into the water. Straight into the water. I, was, went, I went through some things, some tears, some crying in dark corners, some loud, loud debates. <laughs> With the hubby, life is never perfect. But I said, you know what? The devil is a liar. These are all distractions because the minute, I don't know about you, but I know for me, energetically, the minute I get crystal clear about what I want to do and I start getting selfish, that's when everything but the kitchen sink wants to break. That's when everything wants to go on fire. 
that's when every every let me tell you something if you are here to live your purpose i need you to tell me what that purpose is right now because as entrepreneurs if you are truly a genuine human being you're here to help people i'm here on my vacation with my family <laughs> but genuinely here to help and talk about things you can do to generate your revenue right if you are here to help and live in your purpose the devil gonna come at you <laughs> the devil gonna come at you if you are a spiritual entrepreneur having a spiritual experience tell me i'm lying let me tell you something when i'm netflixing and chilling <laughs> When I'm crying in a corner, when I'm all up in the drama, devil is like, go for it, do what you need to do. I need you to be distracted. When I'm on TikTok, who will be on the TikTok rabbit hole? When I'm scrolling through TikTok for 10 hours, do it girl, do it. Scroll on TikTok for 10 hours. <laughs> the minute I get intentional, life gets crazy. Consistency is understanding that even though distractions are everywhere, you gotta stick to your goal. You gotta stick to your goal, you gotta be selfish, you gotta make it happen. I'm gonna get off my soapbox because that's not why y'all are here, but somebody wanted to hear that. So something told me I needed to pause and say that. Maybe I just needed to hear it out loud, I don't know. <laughs> I needed all of this just finished my newsletter for the week yes my goal is to have multiple items available at an affordable price absolutely yes i love it andrea cindy and sydney cindy i was about to say sydney because my brother-in-law is sydney cindy i want you guys to get specific do you have an offer that you want to share so let's do this let me do two things number one talk to you about the freebies let's get back on track and then number two get specific about what you plan to do to hit your $100 at least $100 a day okay and work on your profit goal so in order for me to do that I got to get rid of this dog real quick let me hand her over if you've learned anything from today any aha moments any offers let me know okay i'm about to go back on this live thank you if you want to keep her you can if you want to take her back upstairs you can whatever works for you you want food yes. there's food upstairs huh? oh you you know what i will give you my pancake that i did not eat you were going to eat it anyway without telling me. Okay. You can eat my you can eat my pancakes and ham. Wow. Are you done? There you go. You have to come back. No. We mean I laid you come out back. a towel. Come back. She laid you out a towel. We'll play some towel. music. Yeah. I'll dance. I got to do some TikTok dances. I'm definitely not coming back. No, you're coming back. <laughs> I will. Don't make me come up there to get you. I'm not going to dance. I promise. Come back. <laughs> I went through all this hard work laying out a towel. Amazing as usual. Hey, Tiffany. You always bring it. That's why I'm here. All right, y'all. Let's do it. So we are back at it. We're going to go back inside the digital product planner. If you don't have it, go get it. So it's sense.shop. If you could drop that link into the comment box for me, I would love you for free. Sister Sense, S I S T A S E N S E dot S H O P. There is a breeze blowing, y'all. Bless God. Let me take off this hat. There is a beautiful breeze blowing. So remember, I mentioned to you that I have 21 types of digital products. And these are my ABCs all the way, well, A to F, okay, of different types of digital products. Uh, this one here is freebie offer, okay? There are about 20 types of them that I talk about anyway. And then I also have different tools that I use to create the freebie offers. So let's run them down and then talk about a freebie funnel. So as far as freebies, I give away eBooks, 
um, or excerpts of books, reports, resource guides. I do webinars and trainings, podcast episodes. Who has a podcast? Anybody have a podcast? Who wants to make a podcast? If you want to make a podcast, I have a training on how to create your own easy podcast. Okay, but quick, 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 quick tutorial. Anchor.fm. A-N-C-H-O-R.fm. Okay. You can listen to my podcast over on anchor.fm forward slash sister sense, number one. But number two, more importantly, you can create your own podcast and share your amazing content on your own podcast. Okay. Infographics, articles, and blog posts. So I said to you that right now my challenge is I am writing 100 articles in 100 days. And I'm doing that on my blog, sistersense.com forward slash blog. And when I decided to do this, I also said, I'm going to share, I'm going to share all the strategies that I'm doing to create content quickly, to create content strategically and to help people make money. So I have the content creation 100 day challenge to go along with me writing. I'm doing this challenge right this week, right now, the content creation challenge is 30 bucks for the hundred days. And you start on day one for a hundred days. I'm teaching you everything I'm doing to work on my content. That is over at sense.com forward slash M100. And you'll see there is a link to uh, different examples of the things I'm doing right now. One of them is the $30 content creation challenge. It's normally 95. Now it's, no, it's normally 100. It's normally $100 for that challenge. $100 for 100 days, a dollar a day. Uh, now it's 30 bucks for the weekend, okay? So... Um, I do a lot of articles and I create, here's one thing that I do. Okay. When it comes to repurposing content, this live stream, it's on YouTube. So I can repurpose that when I do StreamYard, not only do I get the video, but I get the audio so I can download the audio version of this. I can upload that to my podcast. I can then embed this on my blog as a post. There's so many ways you can repurpose and maximize your content. So I teach these strategies because some of y'all are way too busy for business and you need to be able to QC, QC, quickly create quality content. So a lot of the strategies that I'm talking about, you literally can learn for the next 100 days. It starts on day one, by the way, so you haven't missed anything. If you sign up for the content creation challenge, it starts for you on day one and you get to access, you watch any videos whenever you want. So no, you don't have to create content every day. Absolutely not. You watch the videos when you want, you come back to it when you want, but I'm pouring into you the things that I do. So creating free articles, blog posts, infographics, samples or kits. Um, the lovely Anissa, I don't know, Anissa, are you still here? Um, Anissa came out and hung out with me when I was in New York about two years ago. I did like a little quick workshop in New York. And she gifted me samples of her beautiful products. If Anissa, you could put your link in there or let them know the samples and things that you gave me. And I did a little video when we were together in New York. You can do physical samples of your stuff and you can do digital samples too. So I said to you guys, a lot of what I'm sharing with you, you can start creating using my free ebook template over at sisasense.com forward slash F-E-B-T. Free ebook template, F E B T. Sisterssense.com forward slash F E B T. So I give people away free things ebooks, samples, kits, templates, challenges. I give away free calls, courses, workbooks, worksheets, cheat sheets, printables, free trials, free shipping, or free shipping plus perch or free plus shipping offer. So what that means is either you give them free shipping if they pay a certain amount or you do an offer where they can get it for free. All they have to do is pay for shipping. So they offer, like, let's say it's like, oh, you know, this offer is normally 30 bucks. You can get it for free. Just pay the 9.95 shipping. So free plus shipping. So again, let's run down these freebies. Can you make C? Can you update U or can you designate more time D? So C U D. C-U-D, create, update, designate, more time to work on any of these freebies, ebooks, book excerpts, reports or resource guides, webinars or training, podcasts or show, like a video show, audios, videos, articles, blog posts, infographics, samples, kits, templates, challenges, calls, courses, workbooks, worksheets, 
cheat seats, printables, free trials, free shipping, or a free offer, but they have to pay for shipping. So free plus shipping offer. Those are examples of freebie offers. This is one of the 21 types of digital products that I talk about in the digital product planner at sysosense.shop. Go grab it if you don't have it. The planner includes audios and videos and printables too to help you work on your content to cash flow. It's the content to cash flow digital product planner. Okay. And there are quite a few other planners up there. The 20 minute content planner. This go, this one actually goes with the 100 day content creation challenge. So there are writing prompts in here designed to help you work on basically creating content in 20 minutes or less. So for edits alphabetized like the other planner as well. Um, I don't know how well you can see it again. Um, it's kind of dark. My phone is dark. I don't know how well you guys can see it, but this is the 20 minute content plan. I have five new planners over on sysosense.shop. New comments. Oops. I missed what you guys were saying. Sorry. Okay. So freebie funnels. I'm going to give you a freebie funnel example. Are you ready? If you're ready for the freebie funnel example, drop yes. I need to see a few yeses before I move forward. Tap on the hearts, tap on the love. Feel free to tag a business bestie. Share this out. Sharing is caring. That's what it's all about. Maybe I'll switch out to my blue hat that's full of sand. Man, oh man. I have clothes to change my tops. When I come out here, I batch video content. But we're definitely going to do some things today. I'm going to eat me some jerk chicken, some curry goats, <laughs> some oxtail. I'm Jamaican, so I must eat my food. We had crab, crab legs, and uh, I don't like oysters, but uh, Bri had oysters. Jay and Christopher had soft, soft shell crab. I had crab legs. We had a good time yesterday. We went to the movies, did some things. So are you ready for the freebie funnel? Yes, yes, yes. Tiffany Cooley is in the building. All right, okay. So I want you to first think about an offer that you want to sell because it always starts with a main offer. I say it's not a chicken before the egg situation. A lot of times people create freebies and then they go, okay, eventually I'll sell something. But I just need a freebie first to build my list. I don't know. Any of you ever said that? I just need to make a freebie now to build my list and then eventually I'll figure out something to sell. That's not how it works. That's not how it works, honey. That's not how you make money. <laughs> the paid offer comes first. So I want you to identify a paid offer that you want to either put together and create or a paid offer that you have right now that you want to designate more time to sell, right? CUD, create, update, designate, right? If you have one and it has a link, feel free to drop that link into the comment box. I may not be able to see it at this minute, but I can go back to the live and watch it later, even if you're catching me on the replay side, okay? You can pop a link to an offer or you can create it and then come back here and share it with me. Okay, there you go. So I think about an offer first and then I pull out a part of that offer. I pull out a part of it. So I do that in different ways. One way is to give them X of X parts. So if I have five parts, maybe I'll give you the first of the five. If I have or X of X pages. If I have like a hundred pages, maybe I'll give you five to 10 pages, right? Or a process. Let's say I have a process and I have five steps to the process. Maybe I'll give you the first of the five steps or maybe I'll give you X percentage. So I'll give you a taste, maybe five to 10% of each of the five steps. So I can give you an overview of all five and a little taste of each one. I think about that offer first and what parts I'm going to pull out. Literally today, I'm doing a free training with you. What am I doing? I'm giving you parts of this bad boy right here. 
sell and tell. Okay. So if you were to go over to sisterscents.com forward slash F E B T, you'll see the free ebook template, right? F E B T five pages. You get five pages. You can customize. And if you customize the template, I would love to see email your customizations to me. When you're in Canva, click share at the top right corner, put my email in there. So since at Gmail say, Hey, let's I want to share my template. This is what I'm working on. Yay. <laughs> if you, by the way, want me to do a live training where I teach you guys how to customize, customize the template in Canva, let me know. Either you can email me, sisterscents at gmail.com and say, LaShonda, did you do the training? Can you do a live training? I want to customize this template. Show me how to do it. You could drop in a chat here and let me know if you want me to do a live showing you how to customize the five page easy ebook free template. Um, or you can email me either way. But this is a fri- this is a freebie funnel. Okay. You get that for free, $3.99. Automatically. It takes you to a page that says, listen, baby, (laughs) if you think five pages was awesome, I've got a hundred pages for you. Get the ultimate easy ebook template, $25. Now it retails at 25 this weekend. The hundred page easy ebook template is 10 bucks. So there are times when I do change the price for promotional purposes. That's what we do, but opportunity is expired then it goes back up to 25. Remember, I told you crunch the numbers. We're talking about making $100 a day. If you have one offer at $25, four sales a day, that's $100. One offer at $100, one sale a day, that's $100. You hit your damn goal. You hit your goal. Okay, right? So that freebie funnel goes from a free offer. In this case, it's a free template all the way to a paid offer. That paid offer has two options. The ultimate easy ebook template, 25 bucks, or the print your profits bundle. The print your profits bundle is honestly, I'm retailing it for $300 because it's got a thousand dollars worth of content in there. How is that possible? Well, I have a lot of trainings. Last year I did a training on how to do a book a week for six weeks. I shared six different types of books. I have a training on how to create a planner how to create your own brand January this month, this, no, this year in January, I did a whole training on how to create your own magazine, how to create your own workbook, how to customize notebooks and sell them online. I did a ton of trainings and most of my trainings I do for at least two to $300 and you get all of these templates plus all of these trainings. And right now I'm like, get them all for like 95 bucks. It's crazy. So it's going to retail at 300, even though honestly, if you were to purchase all the things that are in the print your profits bundle, it would be over a thousand dollars worth of stuff because it's not just the templates. Some people just sell the templates. I sell the templates with the training and the formulas and the customization and all the things. I say that to say there is currently a $25 level and then there is the hundred dollars. So you get one thing, the easy ebook template for 25, you get all the things, the bigger bundle for currently a hundred. It's going to go, well, 95, not a hundred, kind of a hundred. Uh, it's going to go up to 295, 300 once this promotion is over. So the reality of the situation is when I create a freebie funnel, I start off with the main offer. The main offer is that ebook template. There is a bigger offer, which is the bundle. There is the free offer, which is the five pages of the 100 pages. It's a process. So even if you don't know the techie parts of putting this sequence together, you should start off with a notebook, just mapping it out. The first step, I want people to get this free offer. Immediately when they get this free offer, they are sent to this offer. This is my main offer. If they buy the main offer, here's an upsell offer, something bigger that they can get. If they don't want the main offer or the upsell offer, here's a downsell offer, something smaller that they can get so that I'm maximizing my profit potential. There are people who will go to the page. They'll just get the free thing. There are people who will go to the page. They'll just pay 25. There are people who will go to the page and they'll pay 95. I also have other options there. These are called cross sells. Cross sells are things that you go, Hmm, if you're going to get this, you might as well get this. You might as well get this. You might as well get this. So honestly on that page, someone can pay to anywhere between 25 to up to $200 
based on the different products on that page, right? That is how you increase your profit per sale by creating an experience where there are multiple offers on the page. This is called a one page sales funnel. So on that sales page, there are multiple My mini me, he's trying to call me and I don't want to hit call and screw up the live. So I'm going to see if I can get his on. Bree! Bree, Bree! Christopher was trying to call me. Can you call him and see what he wanted? So my sales page, by the way, I created that in Sam Card if you're curious. So Sam Cart is amazing at creating savvy sale pages, as I like to call them, one page sales funnels. So there's that one page sales funnel where you can see multiple options on that one page, right? You can see the main offer for 25, the upsell offer, 95, the cross sell offers for anywhere between 50 and 90 or 100, multiple offers on that one page that I can take them to an upsell or a downsell. So lots of options. Okay. He's got to ask me something. Hello? Okay. So take take the whole take the one that's the whole pancake. Take the Okay. You can you can leave the eggs and the small pancake. Take the whole one and the ham. Oh my god, why is this complicated? Yes. Yes, this is not rocket science. Yes. Okay, thank you. Bye. Woo! Mommy mode. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, take the one pancake and the ham. Leave me alone. <laughs> but this is my day. Like, I was on a clarity call with a client. I do my clarity calls on Wednesdays. By the way, this weekend I'm doing $30, 30-minute calls. So if you want to get calls with me, rack up those calls for 30 bucks because I don't do that often. They're normally $100 for 30 minutes and 200 for 60. So anyway, I was on a call with a client last week and I was like, oh my God, my son is calling me. Y'all know the craziness that's been going on in schools right now. I'm not going to even mention the craziness. So he calls me and I'm freaking out. Pick up the phone. He's like, mom. I'm like, yeah. He's like, so you got poster boards, right? I'm like, yes. Oh, okay, because we need poster boards and I need you to pick up so-and-so after school. And I'm like, why are you calling me <laughs> in the middle of the day at school to ask me about poster boards and picking up people? But bless God, I'd rather it be that than anything crazy, right? Amen? With the craziness going on in the world. But my son, he'll call me at random times to ask me random things. So anywho... Where is the Print Your Profits bundle? Oh, um, citizensense.com forward slash um, F-E, no, I'm sorry. You said Print Your Profits, right? P-Y-P-B. P-Y-P stands for Print Your Profits and B stands for bundle. So citizensense.com forward slash P-Y-P-B, that's the Print Your Profits bundle. So that gives you the opportunity to see the ebook. You can just get the ebook by itself. Or you can get the big bundle with the magazine templates, workbook template, planner template, all the templates in the bundle. I had to think about that for a minute. <laughs> Sisasense.com forward slash PYPB for Print Your Profits Bundle. If you could drop that into the comment box for me, I would love you for free. PYP Print Your Profits Bundle. Okay. So that's basically... Like I said, I use Sam Cart for that. That's basically the front end of the freebie funnel. On the front end, they first see the free offer, which is the ebook at citizens.com forward slash F E B T for free ebook template. Then automatically they go to the Sam Cart sales page that shows them the bigger template along with the printer profits bundle. One offers 25, one offers 95. There are also a few other smaller offer on the page that they want to add even more to the cart that they can so that there's an opportunity to generate anywhere between 25 to up to $200 within that sale immediately. Now, 
when they purchase the, let's say they just purchase the main thing, which is the planner, right? There's also um, in the invoice, right? There's the, in the invoice an opportunity to say, hey, now that you got this, do you want that? Okay, to upsell them in the invoice, right? Another thing is there is an email sequence. So when you sign up for the free template, you get your template. First thing you get in your email is the template. Then I also want to give you other things I want to teach you. So I teach you in that series. Um, number one, there's the easy ebook challenge. So I give you that training. Number two, I give you a ton of free ebooks. And I'm like, number one, you could take advantage of just learning from the ebooks, but all of these ebooks I designed using the template, right? So it's a series of emails, educational, informational, other freebies in that sequence. And I want to say it's about four to five emails in that sequence. The email sequence, that email funnel is based on the rule of seven. Most people have to see or hear your marketing message at least seven times before they take action. So this is a situation where ultimately, yes, you're going to get some people who immediately they get the free thing and then they pay for the upsell. But that's not everybody. Some people need a little bit of wow and need a little bit of woo woo, right? Uh, you know, Kim Cole's woo woo woo. Uh, shouting you out, Kim. <laughs> Tag Kim in this. Um, but that's a situation where ultimately you wow, you woo, you generate that revenue, right? So I have the front end funnel and then the back end email sequence that goes with the freebie as well. So to clarify, sign up page number one to get the free thing, immediately go to the sales page number two, mine is built on Sam Cart. So you can see multiple offers, the main offer at 25, the upsell offer at 95, the cross sell multiple order bump offers on that page. There's a downsell option. There's also the reminder in the invoice the one page sales funnel, the back end email sequence, which I do through the convert kit platform. So immediately when they sign up, they're going to get a series of emails, educational videos, other free resources, check in questions, all the things to also work with optimizing conversions. And that is my dear, the freebie nutshell, the freebie funnel in a nutshell, right? Um, using mainly convert kit and Sam cart convert kit for the sign up form. Convert kit to deliver the freebie, convert kit to deliver the email sequence, convert kit to capture e uh, the people who purchase. Because when you purchase something from me, automatically I add you to my email list and I know who you are based on what you purchase. So I use convert kit for a lot of things. Uh, if you want to try out convert kit through me, feel free to do so. Um, if you want the links to some of my favorite tools, go to sense.com forward slash MBGG. MBGG stands for Market Build Grow Guide. ConvertKit is in there. SamCart is in there. A lot of times people go, I want to sign up, LaShonda, but I want to sign up through you to give you the credit for as an affiliate. And you can do so. My links are in that guide. This is sense.com forward slash MBGG for Market Build Grow Guide. Okay. That's the freebie funnel in a nutshell. Um, yeah. Any questions about that, feel free to let me know. But I wanted to be able to to share that with you too. So wow, this training is super long. It's like two hours, way longer than I wanted it to be. I thought I was gonna do 60 minutes, but I'm gonna wrap up, uh, just kind of relax for a bit, chillax for a bit, and then head back upstairs. Uh, ultimately, this is it in a nutshell, okay? I wanted to be able to share 10 different ways that you could potentially work on your goal of making $100 a day, okay? My 10-10 win strategy, ultimately having at least one offer that works for you. I shared a few offers with you from the digital product planner available on Shop. We talked about A, audios, A, affiliates, marketing, B, books, B, bundles, C, calls, C, challenges, downloads, E, virtual events, E, evergreen offers, F, freebie offers, one through 10. Those are a few of the, I would say 10 of the 21 types that I share inside of here, um, along with other things that you can do. So for me, when it comes to everyday sales, number one, it's that 10, 10 win, that 10, 10 win. Um, so I just try to have as many opportunities as possible, as many different touch points 
um, you know, one of my clients, she goes, I love working with you because you always have something for everybody. It doesn't matter how much money you got in your pocket. There is something for you on Sister Sense, <laughs> right? Um, so here are a few possible 10, 10 win strategies for you when it comes to everyday sales. Number one, you could think about creating like a $10 sale, right? Uh, $10 Tuesdays. I said one way you can proactively sell is to proactively sell. Maybe every Tuesdays you share a $10 offer, you give people $10 off, you share a $10 tool, right? Uh, right now I'm doing a sale where my template is my ultimate easy ebook template. Usually it's 25, now it's 10 bucks. Um, or you have a subscription program. My template club, every month I offer easy to edit Canva templates. The template club is at sense.com forward slash TTC. It's 10 bucks a month, a subscription offer, a tool, $10 offers, $5 offers to kind of grease the wheels, get people used to you and working with them over time. That's something that you can do, right? One of the things that I want to share with you when it comes to 10, 10 win is to think about conversion marketing. Okay. The reality is that conversion marketing matters most. Yes. I love content marketing. Yes. I love online marketing but conversion matters most, okay? So I'm gonna to talk to you for a few minutes about conversion. The average conversion rate is two to 5%, two to 5%. What does that mean? That means that for everybody who goes to your sales page, if you are doing the absolute most that you need to do to effectively sell, you should be seeing at least two to 5% of those people that come to your page buying your stuff. So for easy math, that means that if 100 people, for every 100 people who go to your page, right? Let's say we're looking at the 2%, okay? You get two people, that's 2%, okay? For every 100 people to go to your page. So that means you gotta work on getting more people to go to your page and you gotta work on getting better at conversions. High conversion is 10%. That would mean that for every 100 people that go to your page, 10 people buy, okay? That's that's like amazing conversion. On average, most marketers get around two to 5%, okay? So when you think about that, what you wanna be able to do is to have a few ways to get people to your offers, right? So I've been giving away free things all weekend. I've been doing live streams. I've been checking in and, you know, with individuals who have reached out and asked me questions. I have free guides. I got a lot of different ways to attract people, right? Um, I'm doing blogs. I have podcast episodes. One of the things I talk about for me is organic marketing. I don't do paid ads, so I can't teach you that, but I do a lot of different organic marketing, whether it be videos, lives, podcasting, freebies, blogging, the things. And if you have each of these things driving real people to you, even if it's one or two or 10 people to you, that's how you hit those traffic goals of getting those one, two, three, 10, 50, 100 plus people to you consistently to generate revenue. So when it comes to making this real for you, first part of it is the offers, but then also it's the traffic. It's you having funnels to consistently repeat and communicate with people. So sales funnels matter, which is why I talked to you about the freebie funnel. But then you also thinking about how many different ways am I gonna market and am I gonna put myself out there to have conversations with people that turn into actual conversions, right? So whether I'm doing a podcast or a video or I'm sending out an email today or I'm writing articles today, I'm finding different ways to intentionally work on marketing to my audience. Because yes, you can do paid ads, but let's face it, some of y'all have done ads and it ain't paying off for you. You put more money in than you get now, right? So ads do work, but it requires a lot of time and a lot of money to figure out how to get them to work either by yourself or with the help of other more experienced advertisers. So I'm always about how you can get paid without ads, how you can get paid with content, with organic marketing, because these things ultimately work for me. They were around before all of these big ads, social media, marketing strategies, and they will be around after them as well, right? So just, just food for thought, okay? So when it comes to your 10, 10 wins in your everyday sales, 
I want you to think about potentially putting more daily deals together, having promotions that you do. Maybe you want to do some weekly webinars, you know, doing some live or pre-recorded webinar content for your audience. Maybe you want to work on get this guides, those freebie guides where you're sharing affiliate offers. Maybe you want to work on maybe doing simple subscription programs, right? Simple subscriptions. So you're not always trying to get new people, but you have a foundational set of people who are consistently paying you because they're on different subscription based offers with you. A whole other conversation, but definitely food for you to chew, to consider. So, whoo! Stick a fork in me, hun. I am done. <laughs> Woo. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this. Um, I would love to know, number one, if you learned anything or if you got anything, what you got specifically from today's session, um, feel free to tag a business bestie and or share it out. As I mentioned before, I try to give you guys 10, 10 win, at least 10 ways that you could potentially work on creating digital products that can help you work on your content to cash flow goals, right? Um, I shared audio offers, affiliate offers, books, bundles, calls, challenges, downloads, events, evergreen offers, and freebie offers too. 10 ways that you can work on your digital product plans, your profit plan. I also talked about um, freebie funnels, conversion marketing, creating conversations, 10, 10 wins, everyday sales, um, just a few other things that I wanted to share with you. I feel like I need to stretch. <laughs> I did not plan on doing this for two hours, but I love y'all for free. <laughs> Woo. Let me see. Let me see. My hand hurts. <laughs> Have you been taking notes, Andrea? Have you been taking notes? Now jump in the water. I know, right? I need to do that. I'll do, I'll do a change and go do that a little bit later. We got one more day, one more day. So um, probably I'm thinking about doing the Ferris wheel a little bit later. Definitely got to get my, my jerk chicken. Got to get my jerk chicken today. Man, I should have went yesterday. Uh, but lots to do today. And it's only 10, so we still have an awesome full day. Um, lots of fun things. If you do want to work on any of these with me privately, I always say that you can always email me, sense at gmail.com, number one. Number two, when you're on the sense.com website, you can always click that gray tab on the right to send me a voice message. And of course, number three, if you are looking for that one-on-one -on -one clarity, go over to sense.com forward slash call me so that you can schedule a call, whether it be a 30-minute call, a 60-minute call, or you can do a content creation session where you and I are mapping out your content together or an implementation session or a strategy session. Whatever you need, I got you, boo, okay? So as I mentioned before, this is a holiday weekend, so um, I do have $30 clarity calls for $30 for 30 minutes, $60 for 60 minutes, and I'm doing half off all of my big bundles. So if you're like, listen, me and you, I need to be like your bestie. I need to be on the phone with you like every every week or at least twice a month. I would say get one of those bigger bundles, but they're all, I was about to say half off. No, I think they're 60% off. All my one-on-one -on -one coaching bundles are 60% off for the holiday weekend at sense.com forward slash call me, okay? So those resources, I'm gonna schedule a call. Okay, awesome, awesome. Uh, and those resources are available over at sense.com forward slash call me. There you go. There you go. So Andrea said her hand hurts because she's been writing. She's been rocking out. Um, I would love to know, like I mentioned before, if any of these ABCs resonated with you, okay? I'm an audio kind of girl. I know I'm trying to get cute in front of the camera and do a lot of video with you guys this weekend but I do a lot of audio content. So let me know, as far as digital products are concerned, if any of these hit, drop the name in the, to the comments, especially y'all who are listening live. 
and you who are listening on the replay side comment too i want to see you okay do you want to create update or designate time to create audio content if so drop audio into the comments i want to see like what kind of offers you guys are thinking about coming up with um if you're looking to do affiliate marketing drop affiliate into the comment box maybe you want to work on some books so remember, I talked about different books. Maybe you want to do print-on-demand books, like workbooks and planners and journals and notebooks, coloring books. Maybe you want to do e-books, digital books. Maybe you want to do audio books, which I love. Uh, maybe you want to do free books, like resource guides that you give away for free, but you use them to promote affiliate offers. Um, one of my business besties, LaShonda Brown, she was one of the Power Circle experts for Back to Business last year. She talked about YouTube passive income. Last year, she officially transitioned over to doing YouTube full time. This year, LaShonda, definitely watch her on YouTube. She's awesome, LaShonda Brown. And she is officially on her way to getting six figures in income as a creative. And her main income is YouTube, which is pretty awesome. So affiliate marketing, don't sleep on it, y'all. It's one of a, one of those solid ways for you to consistently generate revenue. So if you're thinking about affiliate marketing number two, I do that as supplementary income when I recommend products to you, but it's not my primary. Um, I do want to create more videos on YouTube. Books, um, bundles. Some of you, maybe you want to create a bundle based on what we talked about today. Calls, maybe you have call opportunities or you want to update your call opportunities, either your packages or your prices or maybe you want to designate more time to promote your call opportunities. Number six is challenges. Anybody interested in creating challenges? I dropped that into the chat box right now. As I mentioned before, I'm doing the content creation challenge 100 days to help you work on turning your content into cash flow. This weekend, the content creation challenge is 30 bucks. It's one of the promotions I'm doing over on sense.com forward slash exclusive. So on sense.com forward slash exclusive, I have freebies. I have $30 deals, all the deals, all the deals, all the good goods, sensesense.com forward slash exclusive. The content creation challenge is one of them. D, I talked about downloads. Do you want to work on having things that people can download? Templates, ebooks, audios, videos, guides, worksheets, workbooks, cheat books, all the things. I talked about events. Who wants to start doing more virtual events, webinars, summits, weekend workshops, quarterly? seasonal who wants to start doing that i talked about number nine evergreen content that you can sell that sells for you like clockwork consistently i also talked about freebies being able to get paid with free so hopefully when i come back and listen to this the audio is okay because the waves not even the people because i feel like there are a lot of people on the beach but they're pretty quiet i mean comparatively speaking as far as where i am versus where other people are on the beach but the waves i'm like can y'all even hear me <laughs> but let me know this is my again my abc method to content creation and monetization my method to making digital products i always start with a audios and affiliate marketing then i go into b books and bundles then i go into c calls classes courses challenges continuity programs d digital libraries digital magazines downloads quite a few d's uh, ease like events and evergreen offers, freebies, freelance offers. I am a service professional, so I do a lot of freelancing. Um, all the ABCs are here. And nope, not that one. That's a 20 minute content plan. All the ABCs are here in the digital product planner over at suspense.shop. The suspense.shop is where you can order and see the digital, no, actually the print planners the digital product planner and the other planners that I've created for you. I'm doing eBooks and now I want to do a notebook and a journal. Okay, awesome. So I do have a training on how you can create your own print on demand notebooks and journals and you get access to all of those inside of the Print Your Profits bundle at sense.com forward slash PYP feed. So I feel like Andrea, you have, because I feel like I've saw your travel journal, either the travel journal or the planner you posted in our group. By the way, if you're not in my Facebook group, it's over at firestarters.com. That's the Facebook community. 
Uh, I've got awesome ladies like LaVon and Andrea Andrella. She just posted her second issue using the magazine template. Um, so as you guys are creating your content, definitely share them with me via email, gmail.com or paste them in our post Facebook group over at firestarters.sussense.com. Plus, you can see all the other awesome good goods that our ladies are posting in our Facebook group as well. So continue to drop into the comment box and share with me. I'm dropping off, but hopefully you enjoyed this session today. Okay? Mwah. Love you for free. Y'all stay blessed, stay positive, stay powerful, stay productive. Till next time, take care. Mwah. Bye.